intro music. Yeah! Woohoo! Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today, here to talk to you about, well, things that make Rev mad. Though it's really surprising because this game could never do anything to make us mad, right? <laughs> Nothing at all. Ever. Yay. It's a wonderful game. We play here because we love it so much. Right? Right. I want to talk today about an issue that I really have with something they did last week that, well, it's basically been confirmed what I thought. Now, I didn't want to give the reasoning of why I thought it was this way, and I haven't really talked about this in a video before. And I know the beginning of this sounds a little confusing. I promise it's going to get explained as you watch. But I have a serious issue with how they handled something and didn't communicate it. <laughs> surprise, surprise. When has that ever happened before? Never. Ever. We've never had this issue. Communication has always been... Perfect! Chef's kiss! That's been great! It's always... <sighs> Rev being dramatic aside, seriously, it does kind of frustrate me. What I'm talking about is your California class event right here. Now, for those who are unaware, I did not ever make a video about this, and I didn't do that for a very specific reason. What I did was tell people that, hey, if you are a free-to-play player especially, but any player, save this event and farm it every week for free resources. Now, let me go ahead and say at the very beginning of this video, I realize this is not the original intention. The California class SMS is designed to launch 10 times. It's designed to go so that you can get a free version of the Cerritos and that's it. Now, if you bought the battle pass when the Cerritos came out, you got 50 right there. And then other players use the event stores to get more Cerritos blueprints so they could keep this event. The entire purpose is so that we could keep collecting these resources. Now, I wanna point out real quick, that, and you see this is level 43, you weren't getting a crap ton of resources. Like, just take a look at my four star. 49, 29, 20. So, 98 four star every week is what I was getting. That's game breaking. Like that. Gosh, how much is that in a year? That'd be, times 52, is like 5,000 a year or something? That's, that's it. 5,000 extra four-star a year. That's that's the big argument. I want to point out real quick that the battle pass that I collected most recently <laughs> gave 600 in one, uh, just one go, six times on the free path, what I just got this Wednesday, and then on the pay path, more. But <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that doesn't count the one I have coming up on the 17th that has 1,000 in it. But anyway, what happened is I was teaching players in live streams, hey, save the California class event. Don't complete it and just do the first three every time it comes around and then use that to farm a little bit of extra uncommon, a little bit of extra titanium. Now, I still have mine because I've still yet to complete 10 of these. And here's what Scopely did. Now, I will say this was not the original intent of this event. So when Rev was teaching the strategy for you to farm it, well, I was kind of going against the overlord's wishes. And I get that. I understand it. I mean, it's not like it was expressly forbidden, but I was taking advantage of the design. And I was teaching people. That's why we didn't make a YouTube video about it. We just talked about it in live streams. And eventually, they caught on. It had been going for months, and then they were eventually just like, something squirrely is going on. So they ended up doing this right here. Big old customer support ticket. Now, if you remember a week ago today, they released a comp chest for a bunch of problems. And one of those chests they slipped in was this right here. Sorry, I had to adjust my green screen. It was bugging the heck out of me. They did this. They gave you 10 Cerritos blueprints out of nowhere on the 7th of September. You're like, why did I get Cerritos blueprints? Oh, well, let's read what customer support said. Hey there, Chess here. Thanks so much, Chess. Chess, not checkered. <laughs> Thanks for contacting us about missing California class event. We do apologize for the delay response. We're receiving a high number of tickets. What happens when your game breaks every day, gum day? Shout out to like several servers who've got 30 minutes of lag and delayed score. As per checking, we sent 10 Cerritos blueprints from the compensation chest on the 7th of September. Please know that this also counted as one of the event completed and this is the reason why not showing your event. Hope this helps. Let us know if you need assistance. Yeah, we'll do that chess. Thanks. Now, just in case you're thinking like, oh, Rev, you're being a little bit dramatic, you're being overboard, that's not the reason why. Um, no, it is, and it was intentional because we can even go to, say, my Discord 
And you can see other people giving screenshots where Jeff here went even, even more specific. He's like, hey, you did the event here, you did the event here, you did the event here, you did the event here. And then, oh yeah, we also gave you the California class gimme. So what they end up doing is they slid in a gift chest to stop people from farming this event. Enough people had gotten to nine out of 10 and were not completing it because they had gotten their Serenus another way. And the Scope League overlords were like, we're gonna stop them from getting that extra 5,000 uncommon four star at level 43. It's gonna break the game economy. And they slid that in there to prevent people from continuing. Keep in mind, I'm only giving you level 43. I mean, if you're like level 36, the rewards are very small. It's, you, you were farming it, but it wasn't like you were just changing the game. I mean, 30 million Tritanium is nothing at this level. That's like four ship repairs. So anyway, I honestly don't have a big issue, truthfully, with them taking away the secret strategy. We, we released it on Twitch. We talked about it on Twitch all the time, but it's more of how they did it. It's the thief in the night. It's it's the coming out, not explaining, like because I would have been okay. You know, give Rev a slap on the wrist and say, hey, this is not the design of this event. You're supposed to get the ship and it goes away. Okay, you caught me. But they didn't do that. There was no communication. There was nothing. It was just simply... You're doing this. We don't like it. It's kind of like the same thing that happened with Gala, except Gala made a little bit more sense. And at least there was some level of communication. The outcry, the outcry from here is not going to be as loud because not that many people were doing this. I mean, I would estimate a few thousand players, maybe more enough for it to be a blip on the radar, but not enough to probably be doing anything too egregious for people to get too up in arms. Maybe there's more than I'm, you know, guessing. It's more the literally doing it and then not communicating. It just makes it feel kind of shady. Like, it's, it's, I don't even want to use the word scummy. It's just kind of like, talk to your players. Like, explain why. Don't slip it in with a bunch of other gift chests. Which, by the way, the gift chests on September 7th were actually very good. Y'all screwed up the game. You completely jacked it up and made Star Trek Fleet Command unplayable. And you gave a lot of rewards for that. We discussed it in the Discord. I agree. September 7th, you did a good job, Scopely. And giving players stuff. There are some who weren't super happy about it, but still, you gave a comp chest, cool. But sliding this one in with all the others as people are just spam clicking free stuff, because, hey, we're video game players. Who doesn't want free stuff? I want free stuff. Send me more free stuff. Thank you for the free stuff there, Scopely Overlords. But sliding this in so that you can no longer farm this event, mm, that kind of sucks, especially no explanation. Again, I understand that I was teaching players to do in a way that wasn't originally designed. For me to slide things in, and now you have all these players going, well, why am I not getting my event? Lack of communication. It's a consistent thing around these parts. For those who are new here, it's a great game. Star Trek Fleet Command, arguably one of the best communities of any game you will ever play. I strongly believe that, not just as a content creator, but having played with these people for three years. I love this group, and I love the Star Trek IP. But come on, like, be honest. Like, hey, we didn't want y'all doing this. We're going to give you the ship. It's like, as long as people get the ship, you got what it was originally intended to do. It's not like they pulled the event completely and said, those rapscallions, we must punish them. You just kind of made sure that it never happened again and didn't tell nobody. And like, come on, that's not cool, man. It's not cool at all. It's just... It goes back to the issues we're having. Like, it's not necessarily a bad move, like... I'm not sitting here say bring it back like I was with Gala and thank you for listening to the community on that. It's just how you treat your players and how you communicate with them. And there's a reason this leaves a bad taste in people's mouths. I mean, this could have been done in a way that was understandable and amicable. Instead, it was just kind of like, we're going to sneak it in there. And now everybody who was planning on this event and was strategizing, I just feel like we're getting punished for strategizing in, in September. It's like, just blindly play the game. Oh, anyway. So there's your little, um, <laughs> now you know. And if you dislike or like, like the video. And let me know what you think in the comment section. Like, do you think that this was wrong? Do you have a problem with it? I personally think, like I understand the event was not designed to be farmed like I was doing it, but it's an event. Like what, what's the big deal? I mean, I farm daily events too. I mean, it's just, sometimes you do, sometimes you don't. I, I don't know. I guess I have mixed feelings on the motive of why they did it, but I truly have a problem with how they went about it. And the fact that even customer support is telling people like, yeah, we slid you the comp chest so we get that event out of here. 
Come on, man. It's not even like this event was paying out great. Like, that's the thing. It's not even like this was like a Jelly Brawl level payout or a, a Parabellum payout. It was like a really tiny, just a few extra. And if 5,000 extra four-star on Common Crystal is that big of a deal, well, I don't know. I guess I just don't understand the game economy. Just revs a big Dumbo. But I'm your Dumbo, and I want to know what y'all think. So comment down below. Let me know. Live long and prosper. Stay safe for the Space Cowboys. Deuces. That's me. Catch you on the next one. Howdy. An even better outro than the intro. For the empire and glory to your house.